Hey everyone, my name is Akib and I'm back again with yet another amazing video on automation by which you can save your manual efforts and time and energy. So guys, here in this video, I would like to set up an automation by integrating Formstack application with Zoho campaigns. Now let me show you how this is going to work. So guys, this will be the flow of this automation. So guys, here we have taken the example of form stack application to create a form by which you can collect leads for a business. So it can be a kind of subscription form or contact form that can be embedded and shared with your audience on website and, or, or on social media. Okay. So as and when any person is going to submit this form, you are going to generate a lead and that same lead is going to be delivered as a subscriber in Zoho campaigns automatically. So here you need not to manually collect and sort out the details of the lead from Formstack and manually add those leads one by one in Zoho campaigns. So it will surely save your time and your manual efforts and automate and streamline your lead collection process. And to make this happen, we are using Pabli Connect, which is an integration and automation tool. And guys, the best part of setting up this automation is that you will not require any coding skills or programming knowledge. So anyone can set up this automation very easily. So now let's set up this automation together. So to start setting up this automation, first of all, you need to log in and reach the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Okay. So for this, you can check the link that we have pasted in the description for you from where you can set up your free Pabli Connect account in just two minutes and it will provide you 100 free automation tasks for every new month. Okay, so after setting up your account, you can log in and reach the dashboard of Pabli Connect like this. And on this page, guys, you have to start working by creating a workflow of automation. So to create a workflow, you just have to click here on this create workflow button like this. And here you can provide a suitable name to your workflow. So let me fill the name here. So here I've given the name to this workflow as add form stack leads into Zoho campaigns automatically. Okay. Now you can click here on this create button and you can see your workflow getting created here like this. Okay. And on this page, guys, you will find these two things, the trigger and the action. So this automation is going to work on these two things. So the trigger here is the happening of that event, which is going to trigger or start this workflow. Okay. So it is saying when this happens and the action would be the response towards that trigger. So guys, uh, here you have to set up your trigger first. So from this choose app field, you have to choose your trigger application. So in our case, the trigger application is form stack. So you have to search here form stack. Mm, here is form stack guys select it and the trigger event would be a new form submission so it will trigger this workflow when a new form submission is received then click on connect and from this window select add new connection then click on connect with form stack okay so and from this page, it will ask for uh, it, it will ask you to log in into form stack if you are not logged in as I have already logged in here, it is just asking me to authorize and you just have to click here. So provide these access, you have to click on add authorize here on the authorize button click here and you will be connected with form stack like this. Okay. Now it will ask which form you are using to collect the leads. So here I have created a form. Uh, let me show you in the form section of form stack, I have uh, these three forms and this is the form, the lead form that I'm using to collect the leads. Okay. So I'm going to select this form from this list lead form. Okay. Then click on save and send test request and it will, it will start showing this waiting for response. So this means now you have to perform a test submission or you have to fill the form on the behalf of any demo lead. And we are going to capture that demo lead here in public connect. So here is my form. I have opened this form and let me fill the details of this form. So first field is the name field. I am putting my name here only. Okay. And my email address also. Right here you can put the phone number. And I'm going to submit this form and you can see the form was submitted successfully. Now let me show you in public connect if we, if we got the data of this form response. And here you can see 
in this response received section we got the details so this is how you can capture the form response here now i want to add this person uh, the lead uh, as a subscriber in zoho campaigns for that to happen you have to connect zoho campaigns application in the sections tab so from this choose a field search for zoho campaigns this one okay then you have to select the action event so the action event would be add or update subscriber so it will add a new subs uh, it will add a new contact and verify it by a confirmation email to subscriber okay then click on connect and from this window select add new connection and then click on connect with zoho campaigns so here it will ask you to enter the domain your zoho accounts belongs to so here let me show you my this is my zoho account guys and so guys my zoho campaign application belongs to uh, zoho.in domain so you have to select your domain accordingly and just copy the domain from here paste it here okay and then click on save okay and it will bring you to the login window of zoho campaigns like this so here you have to put your login credentials so let me uh, fill um, uh, fill these things So this is how you can connect with Zoho campaigns. Okay, now here it will ask for the list in which you want to add this uh, lead as a subscriber. So you can create list of subscribers here. So this is my campaigns dashboard guys. And so guys in Zoho campaigns, you can create lists like these under this contact section. And here you can see I have these three lists and I have this form stack leads list and I want to add this uh, lead that I collected from form stack here in Pavli Connect in this list only. So you have to find your list uh, from this uh, list field, field here, okay? So you will find the name of the list here, select it and then map these details required to create a contact in the list or subscriber in the list. So I am going to use the details that, that I have received here in the first step to map the details here and to create a contact or a subscriber. Okay, so for the first name, just click here and you will find this form stack step in the drop down. And when you click on it, you will find all the data that you have received from the first step. Okay, so from here only, I'm going to map the last name as well. For the contact e email, use the same process. Okay, and for the company name and the phone number, if you have all the details, you can map all the details here like this. Okay, all right. So I do not have uh, the current address and the city and the country details. So I'm leaving these things blank. These are not compulsory things. Okay, now you can check your connection with uh, Zoho campaigns by clicking on save and send test request and a new person is going to be added here in this list. Okay, so right now I have no one in this list. Okay, and here I'm clicking on save and send test request and let's see what happens. Okay, so it is showing this uh, kind of message and here you can see in the message a confirmation email is sent to the user and user needs to confirm to that email to uh, to be added as a subscriber okay so guys this is how the email will look like from zoho side zoho crm will send you this uh, uh, this kind of email to your leads and as they are going to confirm the subscription by clicking on confirm subscription they are going to be added as subscribers in the contacts list you can see you are all set now let me show you if the if this person who have subscribed to this uh, uh, email is added or not in the zoho campaigns list so i am refreshing the lists page or the contacts page in my list okay in zoho campaigns and here you can see we got akib javed added here as a subscriber or contact okay so this is how it is going to work in real time guys and let me give you a quick recap what we have done here. So we are done setting up this automation and here, first of all, I connected form stack application in the trigger section and filled the form on the behalf of a demo lead and captured the data of a demo lead here. After this, I connected Zoho campaigns in the action step and mapped the data required to create a contact here. And we have seen as I clicked on save and send test request, we have received a confirmation email and as I clicked on confirm subscription the person got added here in zoho campaigns and guys you have to set up this automation and map this data only once after that you don't have to touch this workflow after that as and when any person is going to fill the form and click on subscribe button from the email 
the person is going to be added in your Zoho campaigns list automatically. And guys, the good part is you can use this same workflow of automation that I have just created because I'm going to paste the link of this same workflow in the description so that you can clone it in your own free Pabli Connect account and start using this automation instantly. Guys, thank you so much for watching our video and please, please let us know how our automation ideas are helping you in the comment section. And if you have any queries related to this application, please ask your queries from this forum link and do check the pricing of this application from this link. And guys, we are open to ideas. If you want us that we should make videos on other aspects of your business, please do let us know in the comment section. And if you like our work, please subscribe to our channel.